Last time we introduced distributive laws and proved that they yield a monadic structure on the composition of the endofunctors involved. In this video, we do the same in terms of string diagrams. So if we have monads S and T on a category E, we define a distributive law in string diagrams as a natural transformation given by the green dot from TS to ST, which satisfies the multiplicative laws and the unit laws given here in string diagrams. We prove that the composition of ST via the distributive law delta with the following structure is a monad on the category E. To prove the associative law for multiplication, we unwind the definitions and draw the corresponding string diagrams with the multiplication involved. Then to show that the top diagram and the bottom diagram are equal, we use the multiplicative law above for the distributive law and replace the relevant dots to obtain the following. Then we use the associative law for multiplication of the monad T to obtain the diagram on the right. Similarly, we can use the lower multiplicative law for a distributive law to obtain the following. And by using the associative law for the multiplication of the monad S, we have the bottom right equality holding. Therefore, the associative law for the multiplication holds. For the unit law, we use the unit law for the monad T to obtain the following. Then we use the bottom unit law for the distributive law above, which gives us the top right diagram. Then by the unit law for the monad S, we have the equality on the right. Similarly, we use the unit law for the monad S, then the top unit law for the distributive law, and the unit law for the monad T to obtain the equality on the bottom. Therefore, the unit law holds. Therefore, the composition ST via the distributive law delta is a monad on E, which completes the proof.